Hey, hey, people. Just want to show some accessories that I put on my uh, expedition here. It's awesome. I love it. I love this bike. These are turn signals and, of course, uh, lights as well. They're not brake lights. They're, you know, they're activated by this. And um, so you can, you can have those signals uh, um, activated like this with this controller here. Now I'm going to left. There's a the left light. It's wireless. It's awesome. You press it again and it shuts off. As you can see, I have 175 miles on it. And I have my phone holder there. It's really handy. And I mounted it on this um, extender. Or I don't know what you call this. But anyways, it just attaches to your handlebars. And it lets you put some accessories there. And have uh you know my mirrors you don't have to put two mirrors on it but i like it the two mirrors it's handy for me i have a little uh tool bag with uh, uh things to repair uh, uh you know a, a um a tire and there's the electric um lock that they give you which is you know kind of it's not not something you want to rely on if you're going to leave your bike unattended for for a while but then you know the orbiter just came in uh, recently when you're not using the lights uh, to you know when you're not using the turn signals they stay on and um, and so the orbiter provides a heck of a lot of space for cargo and I bought this these Ruck Brothers um, um, uh, cargo uh, bag that just attaches with Velcro and it's just really easy and handy and then you can open up both sides and it has pannier bags with a zipper and you know this thing is really handy because you know you open up the bag and you have you have this so you can cover the bag in case it, it rains but then, you know, you can put stuff in here and it has dividers if you want to keep things organized and whatnot. And, uh, you know, store your stuff in there. And it has, you know, a zipper extender as well, you know, to put more stuff in there. So this Rock Brothers uh, bag is just really awesome. I like it a lot. And uh, just to, you know, when you're done with the panniers, just zip it right up again just like that it's just really cool um you know this bike uh i ordered it with uh, two uh two batteries i i wouldn't go without the two i wouldn't buy the one with only one battery it just gives you so much range and uh, a lot of power just you know the thing goes i've i've done 34 miles an hour on this thing bike is super stable it's, uh, you know, I used to have a Yamaha v Vino, uh, 50 cc's before, and I would rather um, ride this thing. I, you know, you got a pedal. You don't have to put a lot of force in those pedals either. You know, it, it just goes um, by just turning the cranks. And uh, you're, you, can, you can put more assist on it on your, on your legs by pushing harder and harder, but and get your exercise if you want. But you know, I find this this bike just amazing. I'm so happy with it. And um, you know, the disc uh, brakes, uh, hydraulics, they're awesome. Really, really awesome. And so I, I lo I'm loving this bike. I can load this uh, Orbiter with my kiteboarding equipment, which is, you know, a big bag with a big kite in there. And then my board on top and tie it up uh, and be safe carrying all that cargo you can put 450 pounds worth of cargo or worth of you know weight on this on this uh electric expedition and it's just it's a beast and it has power and speed and stability and ease of use and com comfort i just love the freaking bike it's awesome so you know i like to be outdoors run errands whatnot this is 
this is the option i i don't know what else is out there that's better this is the first electric bike i've ever had and uh, i did a lot of research before i pulled the trigger on something and and i had discarded this for a while but then i came back to it and i said all right i you know i tried a few different bikes out there i went to uh bicycle shops uh rode uh, other bikes that people were selling around the area and you know the rad runner and uh actually you know the 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 bike that i liked the best after this one was um the uh, specialized uh the cargo version of their specialized but uh no you know too expensive and i don't i don't think it outperforms this thing and you know uh specialize is an incredible product they make incredible bikes so anyways this is uh this is my little review here of what i have and the accessories that i put in and i am super stoked to have this bike and be able to uh go anywhere i want these lights you know i got them from aliexpress about six seven bucks with a controller and they're wireless and and they work really good this I got from AliExpress as well, and um, you know it's cheap, cheap stuff. You know I don't know what that bar cost about three, four bucks or so. I can't remember now, but um, this uh, phone holder came from Electric, which is really good. I love it. It's so, it's just it's not gonna let that phone go away, and and it's handy, and it, you can lock the uh, this thing so that it doesn't ever open up. So it's just really simple to use and, and really uh, useful. And um, anyways, uh, yeah, the uh, bike clock is nothing to rely on for extended periods, but you know, it's okay. If, you, if you're gonna lock it for an extended period, find something else. This is a, it's just good enough to go to the supermarket for, for a minute <laughs> or something like that. But anyways, uh, enjoy, guys. Have a good one. Bye.